Welcome back guys to Dark Souls 2 with myself. Uh, in the last episode we managed to beat the gargoyles. Fuck off. How, how, oh, fuck you bucket. Um, yeah, in the last episode we managed to beat the gargoyles. We also managed to beat the pursuer for the third time. And in this episode I'm going to be making my way down to Sinner's Rise. And I'm going to be beating the shit out of the last lost sinner Ugh. I had a big conversation about this in the last episode and I still make that fucking mistake god damn it uh, da -da 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 -da. I can't remember where to go this is a rooftop I think there's something on this rooftop anyway yeah there is there we are. flame butterfly right grab that shit don't drop off there whatever you do and if you ever you see a message on there saying do it just don't just 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 don't you'll you'll be very disappointed and now onto the area that I hate the most because of those fuckers the explodey bell ends I hate them so much Fuck you guys! Yeah. Um. I'll write it. Right. Uh, we're also going to be uh, healing strayed at some point. Uh, just because there's another NPC that I need to speak to. Kaboom. I don't understand why that opens the gate. And where does this gate go? No, no, no. No, 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 motherfucker. You ain't exploding on my face. Can you climb ladders? That's a no. I'll break all these pots and then kill this guy because he's an asshole. Any more of you? Nope. Good. Now, in here, we have a secrety secret. And then there's a secrety secret on the wall there. And there's another one here. And then... What's up, G? Yep, this asshole. Again. I'm sick of fighting this guy. Just the same as you guys are probably sick of seeing me fight this guy. Over and fucking over again. You ain't stabbing me with your fake Moonlight Grey Sword. I don't fucking think so. Yeah, I win that damage trade. Get fucked, asshole. Give me that Twinkling Titanite. I'm gonna jump this shit and I'm gonna jump back. I always fuck up the run back, or the jump back anyway. Hey! Hey, asshole, you ain't doing nothing. Uh, I'm gonna pick up this bracing knuckle ring. I can't remember where this goes. Roly poly. Oh, yeah. Yep, I remember. We're just here. Uh, da -da 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 yep. I am where I think I am. Uh, just upstairs is Strayed Cell. So I can go and clear out this shit. And I think, I don't know, so I will have to double check whether I have 
a fragrant branch of your because that is what you need to unpetrify stuff and that's how you get to the bonfire I'm gonna also open this gate before I run up there because you know opening gates is all fun see now there's a lot of these guys but they're all just kind of like I don't know just stupid because they just don't do nothing I'm gonna use the Bastille key and open this shit Petrified dragon bone and a flame butterfly, I think that was. Oh, I don't have a... Fuck me. I will, however, open this door. Because, you know, opening doors, they're amazing. No. You ain't doing those sneaky sneaks on me. Biatch. So bitch. Three hits, motherfucker. I don't know whether I can actually shout in my recordings because in my latest No Man's Sky, I think I shouted once or twice in my recording, and I got a lot of mic pop, so I need to be careful with uh, shouting and bawling. Where'd he go? Where did he go? Is he is he like trying to sneak up behind me or something? Yep, he was. Ow. Fuck you, bonfire. Ugh. Why did I use a life gem? Why did I waste a life gem? That was a bit of a silly mistake. Oh yeah. No. Just don't talk to me about this shit. <sighs> right. I'm gonna shoot on down these ladders. Slide on down. <coughs> Pardon me. Pulls on me. You ain't catching me off guard. I need this human. Oh, jeez. Nope. Who the fuck do you think you actually are? Hmm? I don't fucking think so. Nope. Oh, I can't answer the phone right now. Sorry. Uh, jump on down. Can you still hear my phone buzzing? One of uh, one of my friends. Yes, I have friends. One of my friends giving me a phone call because I think he wants me to go on Bloodborne with him, but I can't. I can't. I simply can't. Bring in Luca Teal. And pull this asshole. Come on. There he is. You die, bitch. That's what happens when you kick off with two people. Yeah. yeah. Open the hidden wall. Can't remember what's behind here. I don't think it's too important. Northern Ritual Band and something else. I think it was a soul or something. Large soul of a nameless warrior. Run on across here, pick up these items. Now I do know that in New Game Plus there are two really big fucked up creatures. Just chilling. Uh, on the floor. What's this? Oh, a skeleton. That's 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 nice to know. Hey, asshole! Just just die. Maybe a bit Luke deal. Let's bring in cell sword loot. Or cell sword loot. Cause he likes all that loot.
only reason I'm using the uh, the NPCs guys because what I what I think you guys think about me using NPCs is that I'm kind of using them to cheat a little bit and do the easy thing to run through this game and yeah it does make my life a lot easier when it comes to uh, to bosses and stuff like that but it's not cheating it wouldn't be put in the game if it was classed as cheating back up motherfucker back up and I'm also going to use the Bastille key to open this gate I'm gonna go into my menus use a flame butterfly light my torch light the oil because you know you have to sound like a hillbilly if you need to say oil I'm only gonna light one side though so it's not too easy it's not too hard I don't know, I, I, it makes sense to me. Oh. Ow, how did you still hit me? Stick some lightning on this sword. Safety. Where you going? Wow. wow. That was a bit of a stun lock, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, I'm not never to do that lock again. Who the fuck you hitting? Who the fuck you hitting, you bitch? Thanks, guys. Now, let's move on, shall we? So that is one of the great souls uh, that we have just pulled into our embrace. I embrace all of the souls. And I'll take that fragrant branch of your also. Now, I'm not going to go and get strayed with this fragrant branch. I'm going to do something a little bit different with it. And you will have to find out in the next episode. Because this one, as short as it is, it's coming to an end. Because we beat a great soul. We beat a boss. I am endeavouring to hit one boss an episode. So if that only lasts 10 minutes, it's 10 minutes. If it takes half an hour, 45 minutes, so be it. Wow, that guy's got the sun, the, the moonlight great sword. See, you can get a copy of this sword just up there by killing an NPC up there, but it's fake. It's not the real thing. You have acquired that is it more than is. most undead can say. Yeah, yeah, I can say that. I'm good. Uh, strength is at the place I need it to be. Let's do two on that so I can use a great bow, which is what I'm going to be getting from the old iron keep. Uh, no, actually, I can put those on on my next boss. Uh, wow, I can do a fair few levels. So I can take those to 16. I can take my uh, vigor up to 21, which gives me about 38 extra HP to work with. My endurance and my vitality are going to be going up quite a lot because, like I say, strength build, heavy stuff. Gone up 10 levels. Let's confirm that shit. That's going to leave with 892 souls. But look. I'm going to use the large soul of the Nameless Warrior and get an extra thousand. Uh, I'm going to put my great soul 
into my item box. Same as always. And I'm going to see if I can do any levels. Huh. Huh. You gave me a scare. Does anybody else think this guy sounds like Gandalf? Like from Lord of the Rings, Gandalf. From one of the most well-known movie franchises. And yeah, sh shut up, Irish. Uh, yeah, let's enforce the legs or reinforce the legs. See, it's got an S scaling. I never realized this. And I only noticed it when I watched back the last episode. When you first get the club, it is obviously a standard club. There's not much you can do to it. But when you rank it once or you, you reinforce it once, it goes from an A scaling in strength to an S scaling in strength. So I'll, I'll show you why you that's there. good. Now, if I have the Dranglaic Sword on, it's a plus two, so it's got 216 base attack. See that plus 98? That is with strength scaling, so I get an extra 98 damage on top of 216 through scaling. Now, this is... Oh, it's because it's not main hand. See, there you go. I'm not strong enough to use it, which is why it was bringing up that notification, and it's not giving me the full amount. Oh, no, it is now, because I've got it two-handed. That makes sense. So, I'm only one strength below, but because I have it two-handed, I can use it anyway. And I'm getting 110 extra damage on top of the 198 that it's already given me at plus one. At plus ten, this thing wrecks bosses. Like, I have a playthrough on the Xbox One where I made another strength build. Like, my first ever playthrough was a strength build. And then I made another one uh, purely dedicated to strength. So I didn't level uh, Vigor at all. I left my starting health at what it was. Um, I increased Endurance, obviously, so I could swing a few more times. I increased my Vigor so my equipment load was higher and my strength. That was it. I didn't level Dex whatsoever. And I went through the entire game with just a large club. I got it to plus 10 as quickly as I could and it ruins. Like, I was at Dragon Lake Castle beating the double Dragon Rider boss and it took me about six swings, between six and nine swings per boss to beat them without an NPC. It was ridiculous. Plus, if you keep it standard, don't make it raw, don't infuse it with any sort of element, you can put resins on them. You can put resins on that make we uh, foes even weaker to your attacks. And it was just so cool. I just demolished. You work. Yes, me again. What's your fucking problem? Oh, it's going to be 800 to buy one. That's going to leave me down. I can't level it. Me, 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 me. I'll be around if you make it back. Right. By the next episode, when you come back, guys, this is going to be a plus two club, and we're going to get enough strength to use it so that we can use this S-scaled club to absolutely wipe people off their feet and the pancake, because who doesn't like pancakes? So, guys, thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you've liked the video, please leave a like. Subscribe if you want and share with your friends. That would be a big help. Spread the love. And I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode.